interesting. Yeah, um, for sure. Then it's literally just like, who doesn't hit it first? Right, right. And there are some standings <laughs> you can do. Like, you can do like the mid range throw with Diddy Kong, or with, uh, with, the, with Day to Day from, from long range. <laughs> and then um, time it so that, you know, like you can do that throw at them, and then they'll hit the Gordo back at you. And you can actually re catch it and just throw it directly back at them. Yeah. Um, so there's definitely like some volleys that can go on. You can play some, some real volleyball. Yeah. Volleyball, good sport. <laughs> DDD, a big fan of that. If, uh, if, he, if he jumps, then he has a very. GDD's jump sound is actually very cute too. Oh yeah, he's big, got like big the Kirby like whip, whip. Big fan of his jump sound. It's like a Kirby jump sound except it's like only bass. Right. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Definitely put that through some uh, <laughs> some some channels to lower Absolutely. all the uh, yeah. the words for yeah. music that I used to know but <laughs> no longer do. <laughs> but take it down a couple octaves on the pitch. Mm -hmm. Well, looks like we're going into sure. game one. Gonna be on Battlefield. Battlefield. Okay. Good Marth stage. Yep. Uh, good for Marth. I can only imagine it's also good for DDD. Uh, Possibly. Yeah. Oh. Oh, oh no. no way. Oh, wow. Okay. He, he got the jump. footstool yeah, there. Wow. I, th you know, he, I think he actually he he used his did. double jump immediately. He double oh, jumped he into the battlefield, but then footstool day to day on his way up. Okay. <laughs> so. Uh, wow. That was yeah, he was real he nice. was probably dead if he did not get that footstool. So oh, yeah. uh, shout out to that. Low key, like there's lots of situations where just like matching footstool as you're falling down towards your opponent is a really good idea. Yeah, um, I mean obviously like there, there are times when like uh, you're like you're falling onto stage after you use your jump, use your double jump, and it's like well I have to land it on them now and this sucks because they're shielding. Um, and you know a lot of characters don't have stuff they can, that's actually safe on shield they can do. You can actually just footstool off their shield and be like deuces, I'm going to the other oh, side of the stage yeah. now. For sure. Right now, both these players are playing so well, it's very even, Aww. but Green Lunch is just opening that mouth and just hoping Marth falls in, and right, we'll see yeah. how that works for him. Okay, and now Gibson Rules is just going for up smashes, random smash attacks a lot. I like Speaking that of, one. Yeah, that one. See, look at that noise, that's a good noise. <laughs> <laughs> it's honestly so low that I like can't even really hear it at the yeah. but, uh, I like vibrates my ears more than anything. Yeah. Uh, but Dancing Blade coming out, knocking DDD all the way across. Gordos makes the recovery a little bit safer, but recovers into the tipper F smash. And yeah, being on the stage like that is asking to get hurt, and uh, <laughs> gets definitely hurt. put on the hurt. Yeah. So so hurt, he actually died from it. Extreme death. It's not fun. Ooh, dash tag. Scary setups. I think DDD's animations and sounds are just some of the best in the game because he just like eats dirt whenever he dash tags. Right. Yeah. <laughs> it's real funny. <laughs> And he has like four taunts or five taunts. Ooh. Goes for a hard read on that roll in. Yeah, the downward combinations on Mars Dancing Blade, though. Not going to work on a character as heavy yeah, and floaty as it. Yeah, okay. Again, laying on the stage this time. Unpunished. Gets the hit off. Uh, we'll see if he's able to edge guard this one. Oh, my goodness. Wow. Yeah, pretty good spinning, coverage there. Yes. Spinning, spinning hammer of death. Coming out yeah. from DDD. <laughs> yeah, uh, and like using the Gordos to set up for it, especially. Yeah, yeah, that was oh a little, my little bit of a <laughs> breather there. Uh, wow. Definitely recovering at the very tip of that day to day LP. <laughs> oh, four dares. I got you guys I didn't think <laughs> I was going to make it. I was like, there's no way. <laughs> Hello, I am day to day. <laughs> I have six jumps and a super high up B. I'm, not, I'm never going to die off bottom. Bad. But. Right now, Gibson playing incredibly clean, actually. Yep. Up by quite a bit, and I say that. Now, uh, now Dream Lunge Ooh. playing even better, getting a nice big combo. Oh, okay. scary. The up B coming out at the exact right moment for him, knocking away the Gordo. Because I, I, I don't really think so, only, but. Uh, yeah. Uh, yep, Trump attempt, but. Uh, yeah. Not gonna get it. Not having any of it. Yeah, but pressuring that uh, they get up real quick. Oh, that was kind of strange. Good idea but yeah, a little bit, uh, a little bit out of range. I actually got the first hit, but fell out of the other one. Yeah. Oh. oh Thundercats okay. not gonna do it off the yeah. top quite yet. Battlefield is a big stage, and DDD big penguins. So. Yes, he's definitely not on Weight Watchers. Mm -hmm. Yeah. <laughs> no. <laughs> not even. A, not, not even the slightest. Close. If anything, like the, the reverse. <laughs> yeah. We're trying to put on as much weight as possible. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Right now. Oh, oh, he rolls back into it. No. Dream Lunch taking a big, deep breath. He is very happy about that. Yeah, yeah that's a pretty ballsy. I mean, he tried that earlier yeah. as well and got punished pretty hard for it. Yeah. But this time, uh, Gibson, okay. I guess, not expecting him to try to do it a second time. He can't believe it worked. <laughs> I can't believe it worked. <laughs> I, <laughs> neither can I. That <laughs> was actually kind of crazy. <laughs> pretty nutty. Ooh. Oh my goodness. This, though. Did I just get a bayonet? That is a nasty counterpick. I cannot imagine. Oh, this on Lilac, too. That's not fun. Close. 
Yeah, dealing with gun spam as a normal character on this stage is really difficult. Um, being a big boy? Yeah, being a big boy, too. I mean, I guess he does at least have, like, full option shenanigans that he can do. Um, but we'll see. Yeah, Bennett on this stage can actually uh, fire her guns basically straight. Basically, yeah, yeah. yeah. And it's uh, a lot better for her guns than any other stage. Hmm. Yeah, it's also so low that she can do some off the top combos pretty easily. Yeah, yeah, especially like off of the platforms if she manages to catch something. Absolutely. But right now, Dream Lunge kind of struggling to get in and get the good damage on. Yeah, as uh, you'd probably expect in this matchup. Getting in on Bayonet is a, yeah. a uh -oh. challenge for any character. Uh -oh. Carried off the top, so he was looking for it. He was almost falling out of it every single hit, but DDD's just so big that his model, right, the right. very top part of it was just It's pretty hard stuck. to miss him, honestly. Yeah, that's the problem. <laughs> okay. For some reason, I thought Gibson was dead. He kind of just floated for a little while before using another up to get back. But uh -oh. coming out. Uh -oh. Catching, cool. catching Dream Lunge again, but Dream Lunge getting out of, getting out of the typical Bayonetta combo. Good for him. Gibson a little bit upset about that one, but it's not too upset. He only has 35% of his first stock on yeah. his favorite stage. Yeah, this, this is uh, looking like it's at this point in time you start considering your counter pick <laughs> yeah. for game uh, three. Undoubtedly, yeah. But okay. technically doable, but good luck, man. It's, uh, it's real hard. Yeah, and it's not like oh, um, good attempt, but yeah. <laughs> He wanted, he wanted to carry Bayonetta all the way down, or he wanted to spit her out and then immediately start jumping. Right, so Lylat yeah, yeah. is such a low bottom that mm. it's you kind of can't do that. It's pretty difficult. Yeah. Also, Bayonetta probably Bayonetta also, definitely yeah, made could, it back. Yeah, like, she could have side beat and then up beat again. So, if, if Assuming that Gibson had chosen the correct direction on the side B, I'm pretty sure he would have been yeah. fine. Yeah, yeah. I mean, he Lylat released him basically that. right in the middle to where he could have gone either way and it would be okay. Possibly. But. But going into game three. Yeah, so no surprise, Gibson's staying with the... Uh, same with Bayonetta pick. Obviously a much better pickup for this man. Worked out very well. Honestly, I feel like his Marth did work pretty well too, but then he just like, got caught by silly up and some other yeah. stuff. Yeah. Okay, so releases that F smash a little bit early. I think if he held on to it, it would have caught him. Because awesome. Gibson kind of fell into it, or right where the range was. But the world will never know. Mm -hmm. Up air coming out. Flashing onto the edge that time. Oh, interesting. I look, I look like that spacing on neutral would not have been safe, but yeah. Bandana's air control is really good. Uh -huh, that damage. Oh Getting shot goodness. and then also having the Gordo hit you. Okay. Ouch. It's a dream lunge. Re recovering to the platform, getting knocked off by the guns. That is unfortunate for him. Mm. Man, Gibson just looking so much more dominant on this character. I wonder if he's more comfortable with Bayonetta or it's just a secondary that's working better for Mark for some reason in this particular matchup. Um, if I had to guess, I'd probably say it's the... Uh, the former, yeah, uh, because I don't know. Day to day, just struggles with like basic bayonetta stuff. Honestly. Yep. Oh my goodness. Okay, so just the roll barely getting away from that F smash. Okay. That doesn't matter. Yeah, nice just caught up by an up there. Oh, nice catch on the uh, downward afterburner kick. Yeah. Man. Dream lunge. Ninety-five percent of this first stock. Bayonetta looking at end or uh, Gibson rather looking at end this one immediately though. Doesn't want to get too much built up on him because any damage is bad damage. Yes, and this is actually kind of a scary position because now Day to Day is at higher percent, and now he's gathering rage. So yeah. if you like, if you have one big mistake happen, it, you get back aired off stage once, <laughs> once or twice more. Yeah, could actually just be the stock. Yeah, GDD's back air, so, like incredibly strong and scary, just like that up smash was. The roll get up, good option. <laughs> oh, okay. Now, Sixty-two percent on Bayonetta. Gibson was definitely looking to take this one, this stock a little bit earlier. He just keeps getting hit up. Any of this damage now is just bonus that he wouldn't have had. At this so. point in time, I mean, he can go for, like, ending this game. Day-to-day -day definitely has lots of ways he yeah. can go Ooh. be at 71% with this much rage. And he totally was there with that back. That, that could have done it. But, okay, Gibson not falling off with an air. Just going on stage. Oh, throw, not going to do oh. it. D -d -d big boy, big big penguin. Yes, sir. Heavyweight champion. Oh. Yeah, not, not intimidated by that up anymore. That's yeah, no. Okay, snaps the ledge that time. Go neutral air. Okay. Does eventually kill, but 74% yep, yep. is nothing to shrug at. Dream oh. Lunch has to get something started. Or uh, Gibson, rather, getting something started here. Yeah, I mean, low percent Bayonetta combos are scary in general. So yeah. on lots of damage and on a big body like day-to-day. -day. Not getting out of those anytime soon. That's Thanks for sure. sure. Scary Whoa. setups. Okay. Oh, yep, the down tilt's going to do afterwards. Down tilt is actually, uh, surprisingly, day-to-day's fastest grounded move. Huh. Yeah, that's interesting. <laughs> <laughs> it's actually like his best, like, get off the move. That's interesting. Yeah. Actually. 
Okay, I mean, Gibson is basically even this game back up. He is at 95%, so he's gonna die earlier than did today, unless I'm lying to you. Okay, oh, I'm not. No, okay. <laughs> not getting carried off the top. Very oh. close to back air. Gonna seal the deal, though. Wow, that's unfortunate for yeah. Gibson, but. Neutral aired one too many times in neutral, and that time, ready to scoop him up.